so in this video i'm going to discuss the construct array problem which occurred to in today's code shift challenge so if you have any doubt regarding this you can ping me up on instagram even you can join my discord server i will provide both the links in the comment section i will pin them so this is the number of test cases and you're given number n and you have to construct an array of size n such that for position i'm really sorry it became blurred for position i if it is odd then the sum of first i elements okay is uh it is sum of first i elements sorry let, let me check the question once the sum of first i elements is greater than okay it is greater than the sum of last i elements and if i is even then sum of this i elements is lesser than the sum of last i elements okay so this is the basic thing the basic uh, so the uh, so let me tell you the intuition like whenever it is given the output is 343 minus 343 minus 10 minus 5 remember one thing accept this accept this minus 1 you don't have to consider any of them okay because we are going to find out a shortcut like this is the output that we are going to neglect okay so like in the previous in in a two question before like i uh, gave the intuition so this is also a similar intuition so let's say so remember one thing that this thing this is minus 1 when it is minus 1 it is minus 1 when n is uh, odd right if n mod 2 is equal to equal to 1 then we can print minus 1 for sure this is for sure else we can make an array of size n and then run a loop from i is equals to 0 to i less than n okay uh, let's say k is equals to 0 and if i mod 2 is equal to equal to 0 you can make arr of i as k plus plus else you can make arr of n minus 1 minus i as k plus plus and then print arr so let's see the reason why it took this a, this made this logic okay so let's say if n is equal to 6 which is a even number so it is not going to return minus 1 so if i draw a border over here that is the first one element and last one element what should it happen that this should be greater than this so if i make it 1 and if i make it 0 so this is a valid condition then i take a partition of from here to here and from here to here right and what should be what should we do that this should be greater than this so if i make it 0 and make it 2 this is now 2 plus 0 that is 2 is greater than 1 plus 0 that is 1 okay now this okay this thing so we if i make this 0 and make this 3 so this is 2 and this is 3 plus 1 that is 4 right 4 is greater than 2 okay so like if no matter what this number if i am adding one to this number it will be obviously greater than that okay so this is the condition so if you check the pattern if it is odd uh, sorry if it's like if i i was zero at this position so if i is equal to equal to zero if it is even then we are going to print k to this else we are going to pr printing k to this so okay so this is the pattern so 1 2 3 so it, this is a oscillating pattern okay so if you like i i showed you the proof why it works so this is the basic code uh, that's it thank you